that's yeah, a tough one. I've had so many. Some of them are just being a part of the environment of India and in particular the environment of Mumbai. It's been a while since I've been here. I've been, as I said, four times before and I forgot I had to relearn how to cross your streets in the, uh, the chaotic traffic that you have. But there's a, there's a real charm to, to India. There's a real, I'm excited about the challenge but also the opportunities ahead for India. And uh, I think one of the exciting things was for me was to see how students are embracing that and seeing how the faculty members are trying to tackle that as well. And I think, you know, I enjoy reading your newspaper and to see what's top of mind with, with leaders and uh, both business and the, and the uh, government leaders here and then to connect that with where the students' minds are at and try to get them, encourage them to kind of uh, be motivated to go out there and make a difference in what needs to happen in India for India to flourish. So I, I think that's, that's kind of what I'm going to take away in a very positive way. The people at DSIMS have been incredibly supportive and kind to me. I've had way more attention than I deserve. I've had people at my beck and call whenever I wanted to do anything. I'm not accustomed to having so much attention and support. And uh, I guess one of the things I'll always remember is what I won't have when I go back home. I'll have to become more self-sufficient again like I, I normally am there.